the Intergovernmental Fiscal Transfer System Administrative Manual launched in Harare today will push for accountability and transparency when using taxpayers' money. The manual's launch attended by finance, economic development and investment promotion officials, including the minister, paves way for the creation of a strong foundation for the proper use of devolution funds in particular and funds for other national projects. Kimberly Chimbalanga gives us more in the following report. The Intergovernmental Fiscal Transfer System Administrative Manual could help transform the way government and other authorities in the country operate. Speaking at the launch, Chief Secretary in the President's Office, Dr. Martin Rushquire, said priority is to improve efficiency, improving the livelihoods of the people in the process. A number of infrastructure projects have been implemented at lower tiers of government with significant impact recorded on the lives of the majority. He also added that the manual will help communities participate in decision making. Finance, Economic Development and Investment Promotion Minister Mutuli Nube explained the manual. Whose theme is fostering the regional balance through intergovernmental fiscal transfers. The colleagues, the devolution and decentralization agenda is one of our national development strategy one thematic areas which seeks to uphold the tenets enshrined in the constitution of providing uh, for devolution of powers and responsibilities to, to competent provincial or stroke metropolitan councils. He said projects we have a positive impact on the people. Uh, to achieve economic growth and development through a system which is community-based and people-centered uh, uh, that ensures equitable, sustainable, and shared responsibilities in order to benefit the citizens, citizens nationwide. Minister Ngube believes the manual will be vital when devolutional funds are disbursed. It is an irrefutable fact that this trajectory being taken by government will drive productivity, growth, job creation, and ultimately result in improvements in the welfare of the ordinary citizens over the long-term horizon anchored by the famous mantra of the President, His Excellency, Comrade E. Jim Nangagwa, Ratmika Inovakwa, Nevenevayo, Elise. Government has of late been pushing accountability from local authorities. It is, however, generally agreed that the success of the implementation of devolution cannot be done overnight but requires continuous commitment and collaboration among key stakeholders. For ZTN Prime, I'm Kimberly Chimbalanga.